Yo, 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 welcome back to another video, you guys. I got a raid tanking tier list. Uh, this is based off my opinion, uh, what I've seen. Uh, I played uh, most of the tanks in the raid. Um, I love them all, to be honest with you. And I think they're all in a great spot, but it's also based off of Warcraft logs, uh, mainly for normal and heroic, not mythic progression, uh, just for, you know, us average Joes and all that stuff. But uh, they're all in a great spot, guys. I'm serious. Like, you can play any tank right now in the raid and, and perform well, even up to Mythic, um, if you're, you know, looking to push that later on. But definitely heroic, definitely normal. Uh, like I said, based off my opinion, though, and the Warcraft logs and where they're sitting, there are some tanks that I think just edging out just a little bit more. But um, overall, they're all they're all banging right now. So l let's get into it. Uh, first of all, I'm going to start with uh, Blood DK. Uh, I think that they are probably, um, probably low A. Uh, I, I think that their healing is insane. Obviously, if you look at any kind of logs, that, I mean, they're out healing everybody else. They're like twice the healing of some of these other tanks. Uh, so great self-sustain, you know, um, soloing the last the last phase of Sinarth. I don't even know how many times. It, it, they're just, they're really fun to play. It's tons of survivability. Not as much on the damage, I think, side of things. Damage to bosses, damages overall. I think there's a lot of other tanks that beat them out there. So I think they're, yeah, low A, probably high, high, uh, like high B. Uh, we'll stick with low A for now. Um, Prot Warrior. Prot Warrior is insane. Okay, they're S tier. They're insane right now. They're doing so well, even after the nerfs. I, I think just the amount of damage they just basically can ignore uh, is is insane. Like, and their damage to the bosses is wild. Uh, mitigation is really good. And they don't offer the same kind of healing as some of these other tanks, like uh, you know, Blood DK, Guardian Druid, Vengeance, Demon Hunter. But they're really they're they're in a great spot. I think they edge above uh, all the other tanks. I think that are in A tier right now and B tier. Uh, Vengeance Demon Hunter, okay? I think that they are, for sure, I think they're higher than Blood. Uh, I think they're doing a really good job. Great damage mitigation, great healing, great mobility, good damage overall. Uh, in a really good spot. Um, I'm not seeing it. You don't see as much, uh, I think, play. I, at least I haven't personally seen them um, played as much as some, other, some of these other tanks, but I think they're in a really good spot, especially according to Warcraft Logs. Um, uh, and they're, I mean, they're just so much fun, <laughs> to be honest with you. Uh, they're a blast. Uh, Brewmaster, okay? I think Brewmaster, and some of you guys might not agree with me, but I think Brewmaster is right there with Vengeance, Demon Hunter. They're right next to each other. Uh, maybe Brew sliding slightly ahead. You know, some of these one-shot mechanics for some of the bosses, you know, it's nice to basically ignore that. It's, you know, dealt over time because of, you know, you're just your passive or Brewmaster. They do great damage, even including the nerfs. I think they are struggling in so a little bit other areas, you know? Uh, healing not quite as um, uh, as good as some other tanks, but they really shine in a raid scenario more than Mythic Plus. I think I think in higher Mythic Plus stuff scenarios, I think they fall behind some of these other tanks. But in raid, they are popping. I'm seeing so many of them. Look at I mean, look at Warcraft logs, 90, 90th, 95th percentile for normal and heroic. Uh, they're everywhere. As prop warriors, you know, some blood DKs, vengeance. They're they're all every, every tank is everywhere because they're in such a good spot and it's freaking awesome. Okay, I think these other two tanks are falling slightly behind these, um, the ones in A tier right now. Again, I think this is so close, it's not even funny. Guardian Druid uh, does um, great healing, uh, great mobility, um, raid utility. Uh, they have Mark of the Wild buffs, so that's really good. Uh, you are seeing them in normal heroic, pretty high progression. Uh, damage to bosses is pretty damn good. Healing is pretty damn good. Damage mitigation, I think, falls a little bit behind these other ones, especially, obviously, War Prot Warrior, uh, as, a, as does every tank right now. Uh, but they're in a great spot. Prop Paladin, kind of the same situation. I, I think you're, uh, you've got good, uh, you've got good healing, good off healing. You're bringing some raid utility, devotion, aura, um, good damage to bosses. I do think you're falling a little bit behind in damage to bosses. I think mitigation for sure. Um, and, and I just don't think they're quite performing the same as Bru uh, as Blood DK, Brewmaster for sure, Vengeance Demon Hunter, um, and Prop Warrior. I think these three are really shining right now. But like I said. All the tanks are in a great spot. They're fun as shit to play. So if you're looking and not sure what to play in the raid right now, these tanks, all of them are in a good spot. Like I would look up some videos, practice them out, practice with them, uh, try some key, try some raid, raid finder, whatever. There's two wings uh, live right now and see what you like because any of them are viable. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tier list. Let me know what you guys think. If you agree with me, if you don't, I've, I've enjoyed the feedback on the other videos, even the harsh ones, um, but also the positive ones. It's been really amazing. You guys have been great for the community. Uh, if you like the video, like the video, and uh, feel free to hit that subscribe button. Our goal is to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. We get tons of wild content coming out all the time. Uh, we're going to be streaming on Twitch here soon, so keep an eye out for that. Thank you guys so much. Until next time, peace.